Yeah, this is a uh, 2024 uh, gasoline uh, Silverado, which is, uh, what is it, the 2500 HD with the 6.6 .6 liter gas. Having a little trouble. Um, this is actually my dad's truck, one of his uh, service trucks. Um, yesterday, he was hauling a uh, excavator, which is still hooked up. Um, woke up the next morning, you know, after everything's locked up, everything. Uh, the battery went completely dead. Key fob was inside, you know, um, so it wasn't like it was inside here or anywhere close thinking that you know it's you know ready to be started or anything or ignition on but um for some reason it just went completely dead and uh, i had to jump it with a box and right now i'm just sitting in it letting it idle um i don't know if y'all have the same problem uh, comment or you know hit me up uh if y'all have that same problem see it's uh got to drive it a little bit check engine light you know all that stuff you know it clears probably after so many miles several hundred miles or however that is goes through that self check um you know and these things everything's electronic um, i don't really know all the specs on it but i can only assume uh you know i've dealt with denali's and shit you know electric uh electronic uh you know uh, steering and you know just all this stuff that used to be run off a dr uh, the serpentine drive you know now it's all electronic stuff but uh this thing only has one battery unlike you know say all the duramaxes and stuff is dual because of the accessories and stuff um this is not a fully loaded one this is just a uh kind of like a standard uh, uh what do you call it like a service truck you know vinyl stuff um, but yeah that's pretty much what it is let me know if y'all had this problem or you know have an idea what what you think um, I don't see why the trailer would pull anything because I imagine everything is ran off of the ignition so anytime the ignition's off you know but of course you know it could come on because of this key fob crap, you know, thinking that it's, uh, you know, trying to, er, on accessory, so, um, I don't know, just kind of curious, uh, you know, had it on a jump box, now I took it off, and it's running on its own, and, you know, it's just about 14, thought that maybe, you know, it just wasn't getting a charge or something, but, uh, I don't know, just kind of a weird deal brand new truck you know it's got 817 miles on it you know dead you know i don't know how many trailers he's pulled with it maybe that that's an issue a grounding issue but i just can't see why um that would be a big deal you know just kind of random just really random i mean nothing out of the ordinary just drive it came home and just won't, won't start now it's good. I can go ahead and, you know, shut it off. See, push brake, hit the button, it starts. Of course, you know, the trailer and everything else is not connected. Um, I don't know. Other than that, I don't know. Let me know if y'all have this problem.